Hi everyone, Alex is here. Today I'm gonna be talking about the plan that I have for the next six months of my life. Things that I will be avoiding and set a set goal for the next coming 10 years for myself. Before I get started, I invite you to please like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell to have the channel grow, and let's get right into it. The first thing that I'll be doing for the next six months, as I finally noticed that each and every one of us has only one life. We can't keep wasting our time without any explanation whatsoever. Let's say I'm going to take more risks. Risks are very important why I am living. I have no time to waste. I have to start taking big risks as of right now. I will do my best to travel around the world if I can travel around the states right now as I am currently in the United States of America. But moving forward, I will be planning to go outside of the United States to travel, visit other countries around the world. Why not with my family? I can't let my life pass through like that without doing anything on earth. Like now I am aware that I have to be useful and I used to be useful, but I think, I believe that I can be more useful than I can imagine. I will put myself available for people so I can help them each and every day. And so I can be more proud, more proud of myself, more proud of my accomplishment eventually. I have to set bigger goals because I need them. I need them. If I don't set big goals, it's going to be very difficult for me to even reach the later one. But if I plan to have big goals, I will do my best even though I don't reach the full potential of these goals. But at the end of it, if I get stuck, in the middle of my goals, I will accomplish sometimes, some things sometimes anyways. And you know what? If I don't waste my time, I am pretty sure, I am pretty sure that I will win over 99% of people around myself because a lot of people are wasting their times actually. And I will put myself available to connect with high value people, have new connections, have people who can eventually help me out, who can give me guidance, who can help me thrive in the future because I need those stuff to move forward. Number two, I will do my best to avoid losers. When I'm saying losers, I'm not blaming anyone. I'm not putting anyone down. But at the end of it, I will avoid being around people who most of the time see, keep looking at things negatively. If you have a negative perspective about everything, I will stay away. And I will run from you. Legit. I'll, no complaint at all. I, I, I don't I don't like to do that. I, I'm not using to do that, but no complaints at all. No talking, bad talking about other people's. You can't keep doing that to other people. What about you? When people are doing that, like behind your back, it's going to be painful for you. So I avoid doing that. I never used to do that, but I will do my best to s keep staying away of this. Uh, this costs celebrities. Celebrities are earning money, even though you're wasting your time. They are way, they are earning money. You talk about them, you're wasting your time. Stop talking about like soccer players. You can still watch their videos, their games if you have to or if you want to. But stop like talking about them like each and every day for any reason. They don't know you. Ever broke mindset? Broke mindset mean like even before you even start. With the big goals that you have, or little goal, you already put in your mind that we will, you will eventually fail. This is not a good perspective. You have to stay focused and be positive about everything that you might plan. Be positive about your plans generally. When I'm saying to avoid losers, the main thing that I want to point out is that those people never see anything good in life. They most of the time will eventually bring something negative about every good thing you uh, explain them about. So stay away from those people. 
Don't let them discourage you so you can move forward with your life, with your future. I'll be creating a family go getters, contains friends, family members, and strangers where we can discuss about investment, investment about many different things, business ideas where we can share ideas and get the best of all of those so we can take a chance. Take a chance on your future, take a chance on yourself. Uh, take a chance on eventually myself. We will be talking about how we can have a successful life and never chase cheap dopamine. Dopamine, go big, set big goals. And even though you don't get these big goals, you will at least stay in the middle and grab like the, the average of it. If you can't create a go-getter family so we can discuss big investment ideas, business ideas, how to create successful life, or you can avoid to set little goals or very tiny goals, instead create or set very big goals so you can get your full potential like especially about getting those goals reached. Seriously guys, it's way better to be alone than to be around a bunch of no-getters. Those no-getters are there around you to keep you where you at. They are not there to keep pushing you to move forward. I, I, I wanna I wanna I wanna say this. It's way better to be alone than be around a bunch of no-getters who don't work to improve their quality of lives. So we have to work as I am trying to do my best for the next six months so I can create more for myself, change my life and my family's life. Number four, never wait for the right time. Go get it right now. Formulate a plan. Fix a goal, set one goal, two goals, and go get them. Work to actualize it every single day. And don't forget to evaluate yourself every week or every two weeks so you can have a clear idea about what's going on, what's the next step supposed to be. And I will do the same. It is definitely time for myself to choose what to do with my life and get to action. I invite you to do the same. Decide to do something today and just get it started because it's very important to start something today. Like Stop waiting for the right time to just get started. You can do it right now. Work to actualize it every single day and you will get it done eventually. Pick a goal, pick two goals and go. Go for it. You can do it. The most important thing is that never depend on a single source of income. You can start a business, create your LLC, buy appreciate assets, own parts of business like shares in a business, or start a business yourself. You can, you can win big. You can lose. But when you lose, at least you will learn something. You know, but at the end of it, you have nothing to lose. Everything you have is winning. You win or you learn. It's all about that. Start something today. Okay. Number and six, never get depressed for anything. Because if you can't control something, you just can't control it. You didn't have it before. If you have it, give the problem time to get away from you. Make sure you drive yourself from a purpose. You are living for a reason. You are living here. You are on her for a reason. Make sure you have a purpose to help yourself, to help your family, to help your friends and strangers. If you do that, you will get a lot of satisfaction moving forward. And I hope you find these videos helpful and useful. And I invite you to please just like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell to add your channel grow. Aside from that, guys, thank you so much for your time and appreciation.